Yeah, it's like more confidence for me, feeling more comfortable about my second year. So everything is better, like my hockey, my mind, like outside of the ring, my language, like, and I feel easier here. Like I try to do all my best. Yeah, that's all. So yeah, having played in the NHL preseason last year, having a full year of North American hockey, uh, how much different do you feel, especially with the opportunity that's available? this season as well going into this camp oh i feel good like i'm ready to make next step but i don't know what's like the coach at the staff will give an opportunity here in the preseason and then we see yeah you showed a little nasty to your game in penticton is that something that uh, you've always had or is that just more comfortable here well i just try to do my best show my game work hard compete like to do everything for the team like and if I play good, the goal's coming to me. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to ask Nikita, you seem to always be making friends out on the ice with, with the other team, drawing a crowd. Is that a part of your game that you kind of like to get under the skin a little bit of your opponents? I don't know. It's like a part of the show, you know, the game of the show. And I try to make something different to be a, like a pretty good guy on the ice and the love funners, you know. Right. Yeah, is that something like coming up? Because you're not, there are bigger players than you, you're not the biggest, but you play bigger than you actually are, right? Yeah, I'm not scary about that. I'm not the biggest size, but I try to do all the work which big guys doing. Like, it doesn't matter for me. Like, I should do it in the corners or block shots. Doesn't matter which size am I. Like, yeah. That would seem to be a role that would suit you to, I mean, you can play in a top six scoring role, which you do with the Moose, but it seemed like parts of your game, you could also play as a checker, right? Uh, just all different kinds of styles? Oh, probably, yeah. Like, we'll see what the what the mind of the coaches and the staff, where they see me. If they wanted me to do some more checker job, I can, like, yeah. It's, yeah, it's a part of hockey. That shot of yours, Nikita, I don't think it's a surprise to anybody anymore. So are you thinking that you're going to have to, you know, still use it, but but look at other ways to score goals as well this year? Uh, like, what do you... In, in terms of, you know, you've got a wicked shot. So oh, yeah. Goals with that shot. Yeah. Are there other ways now that you're going to have to <laughs> score goals other than just that big shot? You wanted me to score another type of goal, or what? <laughs> <laughs> so we see. We'll see. What do you think you're going to need to? Uh, oh, maybe you know, now that people are more familiar with you. Maybe lacrosse. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, what do they call the Michigan in Moscow? Lacrosse goal style. <laughs> yeah. yeah. How much did getting that one game at the end of last season, and not just getting the game, but playing as well as you did and scoring your first NHL goal? I guess how how much excitement did that create and how much uh, confidence did that help? Yeah, it gave me a lot, like everything. First of all, I think it's to feel easier on the ice with the men's NHL. Like it's not that, like you know, every guy who's playing first game in NHL is a little bit scary, nervous. Yeah, that's done for me. So I feel good. If I will have chance now, I will feel more easy, you know, comfortable, safe on the ice. Yeah. I feel I think it's helps me a lot like in a game everything like in North America it's like I came here to be an NHL player for sure and it's like start from that game just one more for me but talking about comfort level it, it can't be easy for a young player to come over to a new country new language all that have there been some teammates whether it was with the moose or anyone here at camp that has kind of helped you out to kind of make make you a little more comfortable yeah, from the first month here in the Moose, I came in the Moose for the in the May, like for the playoffs, like friends with the old guys here with the staff. So start to stay in North America for all off season, work hard in Toronto. So it's uh, helped me to adapt, adapt here. Yeah, like any guys here in the system helps me and the staff. Everybody like I can't choose one or two guys like everybody helps me right? thanks everybody when you were training this summer in toronto were there any other players from the organization with you over there or just probably perfect yeah, i saw him one time but not a lot of guys in it from other teams a lot was yeah
you get the uh, puck that you the goal puck when we talked to you at the moose end of the season you didn't get the puck yet so with did you end up getting it no <laughs> <laughs> but the staff they they're doing something special for me so i will wait it yeah you, you went back to russia for the summer and you were doing some schooling how did that go uh it's uh, it's university stuff yeah it's it was good i have one or three more years for graduate so yeah like i will come back in russia next summer and, and do this stuff again yeah in the summer everything is good yeah i passed this year in university yeah